Hey, good day, magic makers. Um, I was up for a walk and was just kind of jamming in my own head about uh, teamwork making the dream work. And so I thought I'd record this video. For those of you listening to the podcast version, I apologize about the sound. This is literally just on my phone. So bear with me and hopefully there's some gold that you can mine in this uh, solo conversation. So just going to share a little story. Uh, you know, I'm 18, 19 years into entrepreneurship and uh, I would not be where I am. I would not have the business I have if it was not for working with amazing, inspiring, talented people. Now you might be saying to yourself, I can't afford to work with amazing, inspiring, talented people. And there's been a few things that have really helped me to get to where I am. This has influenced the direction I've taken with Magic Media's business model. When we work with partnerships instead of taking on client projects where somebody would pay us a hundred or two hundred thousand dollars to do a project with them, instead they pay a smaller retainer and then we revenue share for several years. Um, that's not the only way that we've done it and do it. And on that note, we are taking applications right now. So if you want to explore partnering with Magic Media and me, go to magicmedia.com slash partnership, M-A-J-I-K media.com slash partnership. But that's not the only way that we have and do do things. Uh, way back in the day when I was all getting all started on the entrepreneurial path, I had a bunch of different projects, one of which was my meditation library, which as many of you know, have been listened to by several million med meditators and generated substantial passive revenue over the last seven or eight years. Um, for that particular project, I partnered with my buddy Blair, who was an amazing music producer and audio engineer. And he actually approached me about this because he listened to my original library. He loved what I was doing, but didn't love the quality of it. And so he said, hey, let's do this in partial trade, partial partnership. So we did a trade of services and we also, you know, uh, revenue share on, um, on the, the other side once we had something that was actually generating revenue. So that was one way, you know, he came in on something that had potential and he jumped in with me with uh, the great e-course adventure uh, course that we produced a bunch of years ago now. Um, it was like Saturday Night Live meets Indiana Jones in a business training. And that was a nine month production process. I didn't have the money to front nine months worth of work to my tech buddy, Andy, who was doing all the design work and tech work and to Blair, who was doing all the video production and editing. And, and so we did a rev share on that as well. And that was another beautiful partnership with Magic Kids. You know, we're taking story submissions from artists all over the world, music submissions, meditations, and those artists are getting a revenue share um, based on royalties, based on the number of subscribers in the app and, and the amount of engagements with their particular content. So that's just a few ways that partnerships have and can work. Um, what you need as a leader, as the visionary of your project and your team and your mission is a clear idea of what you're here to do. And if you're not clear, then that's motivation to find a coach who can help pull out that vision from you so that it is clear and cohesive so it can be communicated to the other artists and other contributors who may be able to play a vital role in what it is that you're doing. And if you are clear, then is it on paper like a plan so that you could approach some of the amazing creative people in your life, the videographers, the producers, the musicians, the artists, the techies, etc., and show them your plan. It could just be a one or two page plan. It's like, this is what I want to do. This is what it looks like. Here's some samples, some mock-ups, some examples, etc. Do you want to join me on this wild and crazy mission? And then you can negotiate what that revenue share is based on each each contribution to the project. And it's a beautiful thing. You know, it really does take a teamwork to make the dream work. You can't go where you're trying to go alone. It'll take you forever and it won't be nearly as good as it could possibly be if you were to collaborate with other people who have complementary sets of skills that do the other things that you don't love way better than you. And that's one of the beautiful things I love about growing Magic Media, growing Magic Kids, 
partnering with amazing, amazing leaders and teachers and educators in the space is that we get to do these things that like when we all come together and we all bring our gifts to one common goal and cause, that's the magic. That is the sweet spot is when you can collaborate when we can do it together, when everybody lifts up, when we all get on the same page of like, that's where we're going and this is what we're doing and we're all committed, that is the magic. And if you are looking for that dream team in your life or somebody to support you, we are taking applicants for our Magic Media Partnership programs right now. I also have some spots for coaching. If you're looking to go deep, if you're looking to go far, if you want the support and the inspiration to get it done, what is inside of you, what wakes you up in the morning. And if you're not being woken up in a state of inspiration, all the more reason to hire a coach, to have somebody help wake you up from the slumber so that you are activated and enlivened with your mission every single day because god knows the world needs you in an activated state in your superhero state where you are feeling embodied and powerful confident and clear in your purpose and your mission in who you're here to be what you're here to do and the gifts you're here to bring the world and it's so much more fun when we do it together the potential just expands when we do it together, when we bring the right cluster of creativity and people together to do something that's way bigger than each of us as individuals. And it's beauty and it's magic and it's not always easy and clear communications and clear agreements is an important part of the process and you don't have to have a bank account full of cash to find your dream team. You could get started today be creative. Think outside of the box that you might have put yourself into. That limiting thinking will only hold you back. Open yourself up to asking better, bigger questions that allow for the full potential of your expansive nature to be embodied in this moment. Do it. You don't want to do it alone. It's lonely when you do it alone. It's way more fun when you got a crew that you get to climb this magical mountain with. And if I can be that crew, then reach out. If you want to apply, apply. No harm in applying. We'll have a conversation. At the very least, we're going to get inspired by each other. And that's a beautiful thing too. I hope this has been helpful. I hope it's opened up some possibilities. Sit with this for a minute. Do some journaling, free flow journaling around what you want for your creative team that's going to surround you in the life's work you're here to do. Here at Magic Media, we can do anything. We have done anything. We can do anything. We can build apps, mighty networks, communities, memberships, launches, video production, audio production, music production. We do all the things. So if you need all the things and you want all the things, let's have a conversation. I love the things. Let's do this thing.